So typically, we check all our guests in, give them a quick tour, show them around, show them how everything works. And generally, that tour starts at the front door. We have one of these uh, keyed or digital locks. What we do is use the last four numbers of the primary reservation holder's cell number. And uh, we punch those in, turn the keyhole uh, knob to the left, and that gives you access, such as uh, that. And then we are granted access into Posada del Norte. So the front doors kind of open on into the living room. However, we're going to take a quick tour down the hallway that's immediately to the right. This end of the house has four of the five bedrooms, including the master bedroom. So this is a quick view of the master bedroom. It has a sliding door that goes out to the backyard and obviously has a master bathroom with a jetted tub, a walk-in shower, and uh, a toilet. The closet is a lock-off, so it's not accessible to guests. But as you can see, it's a nice size bathroom and, uh, and the bedroom is also quite large. Some guests find that they want to have smaller children sleep with them. So we have uh, inflatable beds and uh, they can be set into this bedroom. The other bedrooms are smaller, more compact and aren't able to accommodate additional beds. But this is uh, on a Shirazi. They all have uh, fire extinguishers, smoke alarms, and TVs. Uh, this is Chianti. So you can see all the rooms are fairly similar. Then we'll go over here to the Zinfandel room. And this has a walk-in closet. So if there's any kind of a formal event, uh, the guests who stay in the master bedroom can use this closet or they can use a hallway closet for uh, any formal wear that they want to hang up. This is one of the three full bathrooms in the house. So this one would easily serve as these bedrooms here. And in the hallway, we also have a half bathroom, which is accessible to the entire house. In this hallway, we also have a first aid kit. Guess you're welcome to use. We also have uh, ironing board and iron. Fire extinguishers are located throughout the house. The living room has a huge TV, smart TV. These ottomans are actually, uh, can be converted into single beds. And then uh, we have one sofa bed in the living room, along with a sofa bed in the music room. And then we can also set up an inflatable bed in the library and we do have these privacy curtains that can be closed between these spaces but it's a big open floor plan um, and you can see whoever's in the kitchen isn't shut off from everybody else everybody's able to congregate and help and cohabitate and it's just one big open floor plan which is nice the final bedroom is down this hallway and um, this one has an access door to the front driveway and is right next to one of the full bathrooms, one of the three full bathrooms. So this is a walk-in shower. And uh, so that's the end of the bathrooms inside the house. So I'm gonna take you out the laundry room and show you the gym. And then we'll feature the backyard. So this gym is accessible to our guests. It has different weight equipment, different exercise balls. It's, uh, these are rubber tiles on the floor and uh, guests can use the equipment at their discretion. So now we'll take you to the backyard.